Hi friends, I am Sainath. Today I am going to share information about Mini Singapore in India. You might be asking, oh, where is the Mini Singapore in India? It is our Danish Kodi. After rescuing Sita, Lord Rama destroyed the bridge with arrow from his bow on request of Vibhishan. Thus, the name of the town became Danish Kodi. Danish Kodi means end of the bow. It is the last point of land on the coast of Tamil Nadu. Sri Lanka is just 18 km from shore. It used to be a flourishing town with beautiful rocky pavement and study house. It was founded by the British in 1880 and was called the Mini Singapore back in the day. There was hospital, post office, school, railway station connecting the mainland to island. Apparently, we had a huge ship and a beautiful port too. I think you might be knowing about the cyclone in Danish Kodi. That cyclone was regarded as one of the most powerful storms to ever strike India on record. On December 23, 1964, at 11.35 pm, a disrupting cyclone hit the shores of Pamban Island and Danish Kodi. Tidal waves rose to al almost 20 feet. There were 5,000 families residing in the area who perished in ocean. Pamban Banu Kodi passenger train killing 200 passengers on board. The town, an important transit point between India and Ceylon, was completely destroyed and has not been rebuilt since prior to cyclone, the town had been an important commercial center with a railway station, customs office, post and telegraph office, two medical institution, one railway hospital, a panchayat union dispensary, a higher elementary school and port office. A port had been six function since 1st March 1940. At least 1,800 people lost their lives as the result of the cyclone. That night, waves rose from both Bay of Bengal and Indian Ocean and pressed on the shores. The government declared the land of ghost town. There were reminding it unfit for inhabitation. The place started gaining more eyeball. The day, apart from 50 to 60 odd fishermen and few local shopkeepers, nobody else live here. The place continues to fascinate history. Our government spent 208 crore rail project is all set to take off after Prime Minister Narendra Modi lays the foundation stone on January 27, 2017 in Madurai. The town and land strip considered Adi Sedu means arrowhead is all set to regain its lost glory as the railways have decided to provide rail connectivity if you like our video please subscribe our channel and smash the like button thank you for watching my video please subscribe our channel and click on the bell icon for our notifications